time for the next uh, game of this tournament. Uh, Strikers FC facing uh, Madrid. Going to through the uh, go through the lineups, starting with the uh, Strikers from the United States, uh, California. No uh, changes there. Have, a, have an extra look at number 10, Vanessa Busso, born 2001. Best scorer of uh, the American team. Team coached by uh, David Hallworth. Strikers playing in uh, their black jerseys versus uh, Madrid from, uh, from Spain with their white uh, jerseys. Uh, here's the Madrid team. Uh, quite a big squad with some uh, overage players. Number four, Lucia. Number 28, Belen. And 29, Jasmine. Now you are allowed to have overage players, but only two on the pitch, uh, on the pitch at the same time. The Madrid lineup here, the entire squad. A big squad they have. <laughs> Football Club Feminine Madrid is the official name. Our schedule is running a bit late though, uh, because of the, the boys final, the first one, going to uh, penalties. These two teams faced off in the group stage, with uh, the girls uh, being in the same group, uh, Madrid won in that game, 3-0, the strikers were actually quite weak. Didn't really have a, any good opportunity to score. Uh, let's see if uh, strikers have learned their, their lesson. Madrid are huge favourites in this game. No doubt about it. Strikers uh, began their tournament uh, defeating TPS 2-1, followed by um, another win against Akerhus 3-2, while Madrid defeated Akerhus as well 2-0, and uh, Madrid uh, also defeating uh, TPS 2-0, and then 3-0 uh, to Madrid in the group final versus Strikers. In the semi-final, Madrid defeated Lyon 4-0, while Strikers defeated uh, the, the champions, uh, Arco, 3-2 in a very close game. Arco had several chances to score, but the Americans were better at converting their chances into goals. And in the end, they won. As I said before, Strikers playing in the white jerseys. And uh, Madrid playing in the white jerseys and strikers in the, the black ones. What needs to be mentioned is that the Americans don't have any over each players. They're actually playing with four that are born uh, 2001. The, the Madrid team also have a couple of um, under age players as well as the, the American team. American team has no overaged players, which makes uh, their performance even more exciting and impressive. Strikers who began their journey Monday, 26th of uh, May at noon with uh, all 16 players meeting up at uh, the airport in Los Angeles and they traveled to Sweden. Arrived at Tuesday, 5 p.m. local time. They've trained here, had a couple of sessions. 
sighting of the city as well. Last year, they uh, ended up at third place in this tournament. Are they going to uh, have a better result? Ending up at uh, second place or as the winners? <coughs> Going for Madrid. This is uh, number nine, Lorena. Busso getting the touch there. Madrid winning the ball back. Good pass there to Marta. Nice combination there, cleared by the Americans. Wonderbach was one of the better players in yesterday's semi-final. Fujimori. Fujimori, very fast midfielder. Also some nice defending there from the um, Spanish team. Throwing for the Americans. And that's uh, Ortin running down the left hand side. Ortin. Ortin with the cross into the keeper's hands. Nice attack here from the Madrid team. Good defending though from the Americans. Winning the ball here is Katie Wong. And the uh, Trapero with the interception. It's a, it's a throw in for the American team. Barcelona players and Madrid fans sitting together. When was the last time we saw that? Barcelona and Madrid, of course, being huge rivals. Wanderbach. Gil Irvin going to take the throw in. Nice pass. This is uh, Lorena. Lorena. Could fire the shot. Shoots just wide. And one of the Americans uh, actually injured uh, during that attack. I think it was uh, Holdworth. Let's take a look at that again. It's actually number 14, Kiko and Nelson. Uh, can't really see what happened there. Something with her knee. 
She seems to be in a lot of pain. Taken off here. A lot of pain inside that knee of uh, Kiko Nelson. ACL injuries are very common within the women's game. Two teams flying back home tomorrow. Strikers all the way back to California. And the Madrid team certainly has a, a shorter flight back home to Madrid. Uso. Nine, Irvin. Feels like this game is going to be a lot tighter than um, the game in the group stage. <coughs> so number three, Martha. Goes to goal. Nice pass to uh, nine, Lorena. Stumbles a bit, his 10, Irene. Done there by uh, Fujimori. Americans are not able, unable to clear that one. And a huge opportunity there arised for Lorena. <coughs> Wong towards Busso. Headed that ball. There's no team teammate there to. Um, Collected. Martha, the left back. Great name for football, Martha. Nicely, nice run here also. Kick given to the Americans. Busso putting some pressure on uh, Lucia. Kill Irvin, right back with the throw in. Trying to find Busso here. Silvia Rubio, the cross towards Paula. Paula with the nice first touch. Nice ball. Irving uh, cleared it to a throw in. Uh, 
Every minute passing by, I'm surprised there's no goal in this game. Would have expected a, a lot of goals in this game. Martha with the throw in. Opportunity through Jasmine, but she couldn't go to goal. Good clearance there. It's the number 10, Irene. Jasmine got a little tackle there. Throwing for for Irvin. Strikers FC is the only American team who ever participated in the Leonard Johansson Academy Trophy. This is the second time they're participating. Free kick, Vanessa Busso. No yellow card though. Nicely done there by Busso. Got the ball from uh, Wanderbach. Ines coming on and uh, Belin as well. Two new players joining the game. Here's the free kick. It's going to be Taylor Becker with her right foot. Goes wide. I believe she tried to curl that. But didn't get a good enough hit. Strike wasn't clean enough. Ten, Irene, amazing with the ball, loses it there. Irene gets it back though, a bit lucky. But the Madrid team can't seem to find that uh, possession-oriented game that uh, brought them here to the final. Played an amazing game versus Lyon earlier today, earlier in the tournament. Um, outclassed. Outplayed Leo one by four nil. Busso couldn't find a through ball to uh, Wanderbach. Number four, Lucia, one of the overaged players, born 99. This really shows how serious 
The Madrid club is taking this tournament, coming here with a couple of overage players. Madrid winning the ball back, a bit lucky there. Ball meant for Maria Isabel, or Mabel also called. That's the name she has on her, her jersey. This is number nine, Lorena. Sylvia Rubio loses that ball. Busa with the touch. Madrid unable to clear it. Martha with the, the mistake. And this is uh, Katie Wong. Lost her footing uh, when she was about to hit that cross. Nicely done there, not big from Anis. This is uh, Belen. Nice pace uh, of Belen. Nice header, just wide. Beautifully done by Belen. And her cross towards the middle. I believe it was a Lorena who had uh, the opportunity there. Lorena at the first post. Nice cross. Just couldn't get the enough uh, clean strike there with her head. Barcelona players who's playing a game later, approximately at noon, local time, Central European time. It's number 50, Wong, taken down, being helped up by uh, Lucia. Nicole Soto is going to deliver this ball. Nicole born 2001. Strike with her right foot. It's a decent strike. Won the box. Winning the ball back. Gets the throw in. The long ball. Oh, missed clearance alone with the keeper. This is Lorena to score, and she does. Madrid's in the lead, scoring the first goal in this game after 21 minutes. And a special goal celebration as well. Missed clearance there by Loreen Pass in uh, strikers and um, a good finish also it's not all about power trying to score goals it's equal important with um, precision
Belen, it's number four, Lucia. Madrid confident, growing here, and they're playing a lot better, and almost scoring another one. Belen fired that wide. Substitution, number 17 coming on, Gillian Ortin. Americans switching things around. Fujimori playing centre back at the moment. Centre back along with Nicole Soto. So, was one of the best players. Well, some hard work there from Busso. Last minute to play of this first half. Each half is 25 minutes. And uh, Madrid leading by one. Going into the second half. If nothing happens here. Could score again though. Martha. Number four, Lucia. Couldn't keep it in play. Lucia, nicely done, great go cross, and so close to scoring another one, just 15 seconds from uh, half time. I don't think the Americans can afford to concede another goal, not before half time anyway. That goal kick is the last kick of the first half. Goal scorer in uh, this first half. Only one. Lorena, number nine. And uh, we'll watch some highlights of the first half. Her goal scored, alone with the keeper. No mistake from her point. And a nice goal. We'll be back with the second half in just a few minutes. But first, some short commercial breaks.
14, Sylvia, Sylvia Rubio Avila, here he is, here he is again, Busso turns it around, it's not the best first touch there, Probably another 17 or 10, lost possession, the cross oh almost finding number nine Lorena with a header great cross there on the back try to get past there with a nutmeg Jimori was one of the better players in the the semi-final for the strikers. She gets a free kick here. Dangerous kick from a Madrid player. Give the Americans a way back in this. Actually kept in play. Won the buck. Busso. Busso not able to find the angle to shoot. Morten. Seventy seven Kelly Hallworth was unable to win the ball back. Three 
Throw in for Madrid. Strikers really pushing up their team here. Trying to win the ball back with their fiscal game. Nicely played there. There's Belen with a bit of space. Goes to goal. Trying to get past her defender. Wins the ball back. Keeps it in play. Nicely done here by Belen. Free kick. Strike is getting the free kick. She was a bit lucky there. Carl Soto not getting past. up here for a moment. Wind coming from uh, the north. Not really affecting the game though. Thirteen, Taylor Becker is going to take this throw in. Five minutes into the second half. Strikers in the black jerseys, has won the bark. Nice tackle. Here's the cross. It's a bit too short and cleared away. There's another cross towards Busso. Headed that way. Holworth. Nice pass. Shooting opportunity. Needs a save by the keeper. American slip there. Taylor Becker. Here's uh, Soto. Unable to clear it. Here's the clearance from Fujimori. Number eight, Ainis, Busso, keeps possession, A sloppy pass from her. American families with their American flag. About 10 parents travel with uh, this team to Sweden. Stay here for a week. Nicely done there. Here's 29 Jasmine. Nice through ball, and uh, the keeper with the save. Number one, Sabrina Monfils. <laughs> Player down there, it's number six, uh, Lina. Needs the medical team. Believe she, her foot got caught there. A lot of pain here. She's uh, most certainly going to be taken off. We already had one injury on. Uh, an American player, number 14, 
Nelson hasn't come back into the game yet. Most likely ruled out for today. Game's on again. Play the way by the Madrid team. Madrid team playing 11 versus 11 though. Free kick, good length, bad clearance, but the uh, Americans do get a free kick. Ten minutes in to the second half, only one goal scored. Quite typical for a final, where the two teams strangle each other's ability. kick not being taken by the goalie though be taken by Soto not long enough it's Garcia losing the ball to Trapero it's Jasmine Irene perhaps the best player in the Spanish team you could just uh, cover that ball. Kelly Holworth, and there's a, another goal kick. Madrid team being coached by Javier Garcia and uh, Maria Tardone and Vicente Segura. and uh, throw in Number 12, Suarez. Long range effort. Goes wide, hitting our bus actually. TV van. <laughs> Feels like this game is uh, losing its uh, its edge. Tempo going down. Madrid just want to keep possession. Now when the it's only 
Approximately 10 minutes left. The Americans can't seem to find a way to go to goal. Of course, losing their number 14 isn't good either. The center back. Uh, Sylvia firing good strike good goalkeeping also from Sabrina Malfis number three Marshak loses that ball here's uh, Maria Isabel also called Mabel Nice here, Lorena. Opportunity. Dribbles a bit too much though. Taken down, no penalty given. Madrid keeps possession. Sylvia. And here's uh, Jasmine. Sylvia. Shoots. Just wide. Good opportunity there for Madrid to score. Anis. Nice dribble there, finding the angle to shoot. Almost scoring. Free kick. Number 11, Trapero. Trapero. Sylvia lost that ball. This uh, one the box. Maybe it needs to go down on the midfield again. Since uh, strikers aren't uh, getting anything up forward. One the box and uh, number 17, Gillian Otin, are the two strikers at the moment. One the box. Laura, Laura Trapero. This is number seven, Maria. Trying to find a cross. Good fending there from the Americans. Substitution. Number 20, Paula coming on. And number 10, Irene also. Irene coming on in just a few moments. Sylvia Rubio trying to find Paul up. This is Becker. Clearing that one away. A goal for Madrid. This late in the game. Most surely mean that the win is in the bag. Long clearance.
think that was a throw in actually. It's not a goal kick. Needs to run back towards the the sideline. Nicely done there by Paula. Goes to goal. Nice pass. Bit too steep though. Mabel. Only a throw in. Throw in for Madrid with less than six minutes to go. Paula with the pass. Tried to find uh, Mabel. Nice technique there from uh, the number nine, Lorena. Here's the cross. Bit too far though. Here's uh, Ortin. Throwing for Madrid. Another throw in. Laura. Irene. Fujimoto. Failed clearance. A bit of commotion here in the defense in the strikers. Almost finding uh, a pass here to Irene for Madrid. There's not a sh another opportunity there. Shot wasted. American coach trying to uh, Fill his players with courage during the last four minutes of the game. Remind you, Strikers um, lost 3 0 to this team in the group stage. Now losing only 1 0. So it's a clear improvement. Nice pass, two versus three here. Lorena, find the pass to Irene. Irene towards uh, Paula. Paula nicely done off the crossbar. That surely would have been a, one of the goals of the tournament if it would have gone in. Nice pass there from uh, number 10, Irene to Paula. And this Nicely taken there. Got the ball over the defender. Turned around to make the shot as well. Substitution being made. 21, 28 going on. Coming on, Belen. Belen, the over each player. Changing with each other.
Only a minute remaining. Strikers uh, pushing everything up here to find uh, some kind of opportunity to score. Number 22, Sarah. Here's number 20, Paula. Irene trying to find the cross. Fujimori with the clearance. Only 30 seconds remaining now. Here's the opportunity they've been waiting for, perhaps. Ball just outside. Going past the sideline. Throwing for Madrid. 20 seconds remaining. Plus maybe a couple of seconds in additional time. Lorena. Goalkeeper's ball. Sabrina Monfils needs to kick it long here. Towards Busso. There's another long ball. Here's the opportunity they might have been waiting for. Three strikers moving up. Need to take the throw in. Quick here. Cleared by uh, the Spanish team. We are playing on additional time here. Referee says one minute, so it's 30 seconds left. <laughs> 25 seconds remaining. Go in, headed away. You can see some smiles and tears. Oh, here's the opportunity, perhaps it's a bit too steep though, that pass, and that was the final Opportunity for the Americans. Strikers going to have to settle for silver in this tournament. And Madrid wins the gold. Defeats Strikers 1-0 after 51 minutes of excitement. Strikers for the first time. Second place in this tournament. Third place last year. And uh, Madrid... Winners of the tournament for the first time. Thank you to both teams for a fantastic final. And we're going to have a look at the highlights of this uh, game. Only one goal scored in the first the half. Lorena, born 2000. The year 2000 scored that goal, who, uh, which uh, decided where the title was going this year. Madrid wins the second, uh, second tournament ever of Leonard Johansson. Last year it was won by Aiko, which was the first time a girl the girls' category ever was played here. Now the Madrid is taking home the trophy. Congratulations to them. We will be joining you again after the prize ceremony in about 15 minutes. Stay tuned for Barcelona versus Mexico in 15 minutes. Here comes both teams to take the prizes of this tournament. And we start with the referees. 
the head referee Tiufliki and her team, please come here and receive your prizes. A big applause for the referees of this match, Tiufliki and her team. Okay, a big applause for the referees of this match. And please welcome up silver medalists of this tournament, Strikish FC from United States of America. Please come up. We've done a fantastic tournament. The girls will receive their medals now from Franco and Ricky. Javier. Trainer of uh, Real Madrid, the football feminine. What about the tournament? Do you like it? I love it. Fantastic. You love it. It was fantastic. It's a very nice word from my heart to hear. Uh, please tell us a little bit about this uh, team. Uh, there are girls who are playing against boys all the year. And I think it's, it's, it's you see when, when they play, uh, it's a little difference. Very, very interesting. Do you have any more tournaments uh, this uh, summer? We are planning to go to Donosti, to Donosti Cup in Sebastian, Spain. Okay. Congratulations. You have done a fantastic tournament. It's nice to see. Thank you very much. Thank you, Javier. And of course, also a fantastic tournament performed by the girls coming all the way from the United States of America. We're so happy to have you here in Solna, Sweden. Okay, dear audience, a big, big, big applaud for Stryker FC from the United States of America, the silver medalist of the tournament. Big applaud. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. And now, the winner of the Naki Wansona Academy Trophy, Girls Class 2014, Club Madrid Football Family! Counts. Here it comes, the evidence of the victory. Okay, dear audience, Club Madrid Football Family! The winner of the Lennart Johansson Academy Trophy Girls Class Year 2014. We wish you all the best in the future, these fantastic football players from Madrid.